In this problem, we are given the equation x plus square root of x equals 1, and we are asked to find the value of x plus 1 over x. First, let us put the problem on the screen. We will solve this step by step with no jumps, and we will keep the reasoning crystal clear. Because square root of x appears, we must note the domain x must be greater than or equal to 0, and square root of x is non-negative. A very clean move here is to substitute let y equal square root of x. Then y is greater than or equal to 0, and x equals y squared. Now rewrite the original equation x plus square root of x equals 1 becomes y squared plus y equals 1. Move everything to one side to get y squared plus y minus 1 equals 0, a quadratic in y. We solve the quadratic in y. Using the quadratic formula, we get y equals negative 1 plus or minus square root of 5, all over 2. That gives two candidates, y equals negative 1 plus square root of 5 over 2, and y equals negative 1 minus square root of 5 over 2. But we must have y greater than or equal to 0. Only the first is non-negative, so that is the valid y. Now, instead of immediately squaring to find x, there is a faster identity path. From y squared plus y equals 1, we can factor the left side as y times y plus 1 equals 1. Divide both sides by y, which is non-negative here, and we get 1 over y equals y plus 1. We want x plus 1 over x. Since x equals y squared, our target becomes y squared plus 1 over y squared. Compute that as y squared plus y plus 1 quantity squared. That equals 2y squared plus 2y plus 1. But from the original relation, y squared equals 1 minus y. Substitute that, we get 2 times 1 minus y plus 2y plus 1, which simplifies to 3. So x plus 1 over x equals 3. Let us verify numerically for completeness from y equals negative 1 plus square root of 5, all over 2, x equals y squared, which simplifies to 3 minus square root of 5, over 2. Therefore, 1 over x equals 3 plus square root of 5, over 2. Adding them gives 3, confirming our result. Therefore, the final answer is 3. Thank you for watching. Tap like, share, and comment and then follow and subscribe for more quick problem solving tips. Let's make maths simple. One video at a time only on Myverse Maths.